What's up guys and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So I'm actually really excited to be recording this right now because believe it or not, the last episode, the last three episodes of Valhalla that you guys saw here were recorded like a week ago. They were recorded before the PS5 came out and it's actually been about a week since I've played this game and I'm super, super excited. You guys may feel a little bit different just because it's still been pretty constant as far as videos but uh i'm really excited because now i get to play it again and i love this game i really do i think it's a great assassin's creed so we're gonna start off Come to me and kiss her because it's been a lot of you have been telling me to break up with her man you guys keep telling me that i don't know i don't want to be a douche but if she pushes me far enough i might i might just break up with her ass i want to see the alliance map so we're not going to go to the mythical world this time. We're going to try and do something a little bit different. We're going to go ahead and uh, explore new ventures in our real world. So we're actually going to do this one. So Chael Bet has traveled to Shirepsha. He has, into a difficult situation. The Shire has been mired in a long war with Rodri, king of the Britons. Chael Bert hopes to negotiate a peace with the Britons of the West. A difficult task for one so green. I hope your tutelage has prepared him well. Indeed. But I think it best if you supervise these talks. If Chilbert can make this work, we will gain a valuable alliance. So Chilbert, if I remember correctly, was the the king that we first helped, you know, become a I king. I will make my way to Shirupsha. I am relieved. He and Ivar should be in Quatford just now. You will find it along the F and Hafun River. If Ivar is with him, I will certainly be needed. So, find and speak to Chelbert. Quatford is in Syrusshire. It can be found between two lakes along the Affin Afrin. Now, remember, typically we give you guys a synopsis of what happens on the last episode. But considering that I haven't played in a while, I don't really remember exactly what happened. I know we were in a mythical world. We went head to head with the builder. It turned out to be, you know what, a mythical creature, boss, crazy shit. And, um, by the way, let me make sure that I am not missing any skills here. Ooh, that looks like it'll be a fun time. And we got some more health. Ooh, 5.2 health? Eh. We may not be wanted here. We may. Yeah. I do not know what the future holds. But I do know. Oh, can it really be over there? Interesting. Oh, no. Okay. Let's head to the longhouse. Oh man, it feels so good to be playing this game. Like I, I genuinely have enjoyed my time so much with Valhalla. And it's it's gonna hurt me to say this, but probably even more than with uh, Odyssey. I love Greek mythology. I love it more than Vikings and stuff, but this game is just really good. Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> Not half bad, boy. But be fierce. Dirty. Strike at my boss. Ivar, are you training the boy or tormenting him? One will lead to the other in time. Eivor, well met. You received my message, and just in time. Our negotiations with the Britons have not yet begun. I will be at your side when they do. Is there anything I should know first? The venerable King Rodri is here. I am to deal with him directly. Rodri is desperate for peace. Ever since we captured his sniveling brother, Goriad. Sounds like a man coughing up snot. Goriad ap Mervin. Rodri waits at the church nearby. Who speaks for Shirepshire in these talks? The last elderman was killed in battle. Bishop Dealov is standing in. Until we get this wet whelp installed. That is his father's wish. I find the idea of leading a Shire on my own quite... quite terrifying. Hmm. It's a weighty title. Don't get ahead of yourself. Don't fret until you have taken up the Elderman's title. 
Too many things can go wrong between now and then. My father thinks me fit already. I shouldn't want to eh, disappoint him. I don't think Future so. Future Elderman, you should speak in the talks as well. But with humility. Rodri is the king and will expect to be treated as one. Rodri will want us to get down on our knees and snip the rosy wind blowing from his ass. I know the man. You've met him. Met him, fought him. He gave me this nick here. Maybe I can give him one back. Remind him some call me king killer. It may be you should stay behind, Ivar. That is not a recipe for a good parley. I'd like you both to be there. To guide me, to judge my fitness. Give us your word then. Your blade stays in its sheath. Eivor, hey, don't make me laugh. We both know what my word is worth. But sure, I will let you do the talking. Probably. Excellent. Now, to the church, I think. Our guests await. This is not gonna go well. This is not gonna go well. It's not far, just across the village. We've been at war with the Britons for coming on two years. The Britons had the best of it. Tell me and my berserkers plowed through their ranks and chased Rodri's brother into a ditch. That's why Rodri's talking peace now. It's thanks to Eva. I am going to enjoy seeing him squeal, the old oak. Not nearly as much as taking him down, though. That would seal my legacy. Your legacy? As king killer. They do not all get away like Borgred did, Wolfkist. Keep the peace, Ivar. What has become of your preening brother? Oh, my brother. He parted. This road is unsure. You are better off leaving that sauntering pole in your wake. <laughs> He's talking about Sigurd. Our Bishop Dealov and King Rodri are ensconced in the church ahead. These houses of Christ. They are all so hard and cold. Yet within his walls, the Christian God unites King Rodri, Bishop Dealov, and myself. On his ground, peace will be made. We could have just walked here. We didn't really have to take Captain the frickin'. Neil, explain to the good bishop our position. Yes, my sovereign. Bishop Dealov. We are deaf to offers of peace until Guriad is returned to us. The king's brother. The is... king's brother is a moldering sack of cow dung. You. I know your face, your stench. Ivar, the one they call boneless. Did I not gift you that scar myself? Ah, you did. And I mean to gift you a gash, you reeking piss pot in your fat fucking skull. Hold, both of you. My lord, this is Jailbelt, the future elderman of this shire and the son of King Chailwolf of Mercia. This green stripling? Elderman? You can piss without help, boy. Now, now, calm everyone. Good faith is all I ask. You know my demands. Until my brother Gwiriad walks free, peace between us is impossible. He is lucky he can walk at all. Fell on his own blade, fleeing from us. I will soon help you fall on yours. Husband, keep your head. It is in our interest to find a way to peace, all of us. First, my brother. First, your head on a pike. Then the runt goes free. Husband, no! Enough! This is a house of God. Let us take some few minutes to gather ourselves, shall we? Eivor, to me, I do not know you well. But Chelbert believes you a steady head. We need such a one. It may be too late. I see the crows of war gathering. I have a hefty sum of silver. Speak to the people here. If the silver will help one bring us toward peace, offer it to them. Okay. 650. Let's go talk. All right, everybody. You are with Rodri, yes? One of his advisors. I am that. Anir ap Kadvarch by name. Address me proper. Tell me, um, soldier. Do you hold sway with your king? He consults me for his every decision. If I push for war, he will agree. If I argue for peace. 
we will follow. Peace is our desired end. Is there a chance that some silver might lead you to counsel your king in the same direction? A sack of silver? For me? Yes, I might amend my advice to Rodri for a tidy sum of shining metal. Yes. Hmm. You're a silver. Hmm. You are a wise warrior. Perhaps the silver will come available. And you, go and take a shit and let me know how it turns out. <laughs> Hold on, I don't want to just give it to the first person. Hold on. This is Jober. Actually, okay, we've got more people. Hold on. Let's see this guy over here. That's Ivar. This. Let's see. Oh, he's in pain. You are Guriat, are you not? Brother to King Rodri. So I am. And a bruised fawn in your bloody game. How do you stand with your brother? My brother loves me well. Yet he can be slow and stubborn. But I, King, I'd have played all this quite differently. What if you had the chance? At the crown. I would leap at the chance to rule. But a man needs wealth to bring down a king. Nobles must be bought, you understand. I make no promises, but I may be able to find you the silver you need. Under what terms? Knock Rodri from his throne. Withdraw all Britain soldiers from Shropshire, and never again threaten this border. If you speak true, I would make that bargain gladly. <sighs> I will see about the silver. He's hurt though, so... This with blood, not pretty words. Should we speak to Ivar? Do what he says. Ivar, lock the doors, murder that sweating pig, and have done with it. If I could find you silver, would that quell your bitterness while we seek peace? Peace? Is that what you think is going to happen here? I told you, I know this bastard. Will silver quiet you? It may, it may not. I would have to see the silver in my hands to know for sure. I feel like he's going to cause the most damage. If there's I, I might give I might give it to him. Let me talk to this guy again. Are you so frightened of the Britons that you fight your battles with well? Yeah, I don't know if I should give it to him. Fuck. Let's speak to him. What is it, Dane? I wish to help you to peace. I will not talk of peace until my brother Gwiliant is returned to me. If you first agree to peace, he will be returned. Would a sum of silver help overleap this difficulty? I cannot be purchased with looted silver, Dane. Stand away. Ah, enough of this nonsense. Ah. Uh, wait, 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 wait. What the fuck is he doing? You again. What of the silver you spoke of? I'm going to give it to this guy. Spend it as you will and tell Rodri his best path is peace. You have a bargain. I have spoken with everyone who matters. I should report what I know to Bishop Deola. I asked around, as you suggested. Have you come to a decision? To whom have you given this silver? The captain of the guard will advise Rodri to sign the agreement. Peace will be yours. Let us pray Rodri takes his advice. Rodri, I see you mocking me. I challenge you. Single Ivar, combat no. now. Boneless Ivar. Spineless, toothless, gutless. You cannot kill me. A dragon will be my death, as my seers have foretold. And your brother. Does your destiny guard him? Guriad! <laughs> by God Almighty, I'll... Get him to safety. Go, quickly. Kill the boneless one. Paint this chapel with his blood. Oh my Bro, this guy is nuts. Eva, what have you done? What the hell? Okay, hold on. I've been playing uh Spider-Man, so I don't remember the controls now. <laughs> Ooh, chopped off his hand. Where you going, son? 
we going with all that sauce? Stomp on his head because why the fuck not? Ivar is just just doesn't ah, care. Now that is Viking art diplomacy. Show the fuckers who the real warriors are. Ah. Ivar, you have scuppered the peace. Do not be fooled by peace, boy. It is just an empty voice between axe blows. Dear Lord, this is a massacre. We have no choice now but to fight our way out of this. Ah, a good test for you, boy. Lord, forgive us. Stay close, Chelbert. You watch my back and I will pull the knives from yours. Dear Lord. Stay here, where it's safest, Bishop. Help me with this fucking door. Ah. I'm gonna need you to relax. I'm collecting all the food. All right, here we go. Oh, this is gonna be crazy. I gotta, I gotta start parrying. Ooh, <laughs> off with your head! So right now the objective is just to clear all of these men, like so. More heads, more! Nasty. Eva. King killer. Fucking maniac. That's more like it. Done. Oh, what the hell? Alright, you know what? Let's use a bow and arrow for a little bit. How about this? There we go. I love this move. It just automatically aims for you until the meter runs off. <laughs> Look at this shit, dude. How crazy is that? And the coolest thing about it is it doesn't waste your arrows. Oh, what? Why am I not pairing that? What the heck? I'm a little rusty. It's okay. Get back in the groove of things. Ooh, break the guard, son. Off with his head. And last one. Oh, no, there's more. There's two more, I think. Ah, oh, because this guy attacks multiple times. What's wrong with this guy? <laughs> okay, hold on. Before we do anything crazy, you gotta, you guys got, you guys got game of tech, man. Let's check this out. We gotta make sure that we uncover all of the secret chests and treasures within this church. Is there anything else there? Anything hidden? Right now, we, we, we've got a war to fight. You know what I'm saying? We've got a lot of shit that has got to be done. Like kill everyone in our path. Hiya! Come here, bitch. Oh my God. Not even once. Off with his head. I'm sorry, the the, the, the brutal combat. It's a little bit rusty around the edges, but again, it's been a week. So let me let me catch up here, boys. Ooh. How about I go like this? And poison them all. Jesus, there's so many of them. Oh, we've got a we uh, weapon rune. That's nice. Oh, that fucking asshole does that multiple times. A 
Eivor, come on, get with the program here. Is that it? Oh my god, we gotta keep going. Oh. Sorry, that was a little bit of the photo mode. Yeah. This ability is insane, dude. There's a flying axe. He survived, which is quite impressive. Wow. But I love this game so much. The scenery is just fantastic. <laughs> Relax. I come in peace. I am not here to kill you. But what the hell's going on? What do you. Oh, okay. Those are good guys. I thought that was a surprise of some sort. Be some sort of villain. You murdered Rodri's brother, you beast. Our one chance at peace is lost. Peace with Rodri is as likely as you dying a virgin, Bishop. It won't happen. He is too canny, too vile. Hmm. I think he was wrong. You nearly got Jailbird killed. You boneless flap of leather. Ah, the diplomat speaks what he really feels. Fail us again, son of Ragnar. And I will send you back to Repton without your limbs. What's done is done. We must plan our next moves before the Britons regroup. They will retreat to their great castle for certain. It's well nigh impregnable. Then we starve them out, attack their supplies, watch them beg for death. Dear God, <laughs> more death, more war, endless refugees. This is our only way forward, dear love. You know the territory best. How can we hurt them? Well, for food and supplies, they stockpile cargo at Wenlakan outpost, down south of Quatford. Rodri has another secret supply line. Ask among the refugees near the river. Those who have fled from occupied villages. Rodri's Britons will strike back long before we can. Indeed. They will send Anir and his soldiers. They train in Wesbury, west of the ruined tower. You do not need me to hold your hand, Eivor. I will head to Wesbury. Scout around. Mm. I know your method of scouting. It always leads to swordplay. I am as regular as Tidewater. I shall go with you. If only to get an honest accounting of our situation. I will meet you both at Westbury then. Once I've done some damage. Until then. Hmm. One last thing. We'll need a field before our battle's done. Try to free any captives you find. They'll swell our ranks. War, we are wary. We got two skill points. Multiple quests accepted. Is that our next uh friend or foe? Friends, peace. I was told you might know where the Britons bring in their supplies. Are we your friends, Dane? I would have it so. After years of blood and gore, looting and burning, forgive us if we don't trust a Dane. Here are the facts. I've known your plight. Your flight. I have no right to ask for help. In Rodri, we share a common enemy. My only wish is to destroy his supply line and bring him to the table, begging for a truce. Once we have peace, you and your kin will no longer walk this land in wretchedness. What you say is good sense. Very well, Dane. Here's what I know. The Britons move their goods through Dustin Quarry. See that tower to the south? That's the Hillgate remnants. Further on, you'll find the stone quarry. And thank you. The Dustin Quarry is located south of the Hillgate remnants. 
Okay, so I guess we got to go there. I mean, can I go and... Go, Sudan. So south. Okay, I'm going to count my mount. And I guess we'll just head over there. If I go to the map, does the map tell us anything? No, it just tells us we have to go that way. Hmm, Hill Gates of Remnants. There it is. That's exactly where we got to go. As a matter of fact, what I should do is probably... Yep. It's better if I just put a marker and head that way. If not, I'm just going to drift away. Hill Gate Remnants. So, got to find the quarry. Which is going to be south of this. But I want to go ahead and get some of the treasure here. Let's see if we can. There might be some enemies around here, so we've got to be. Hmm. Where's the key? Is there a way to go in there? All right, so I'm going to go here. Break this up. Like that key. Break this door. The other side must be barred. I just got a key. What the hell is the key for? Okay. Oh, <laughs> look at that. Sneaky, sneaky. Do we get anything from here? I'm climbing up. There's a treasure. Yep. Ooh, opal stone. Dude, those things are so hard to find. Ooh, whoa. What the hell is that? Silver. Nine silver. Let's go ahead and. sink up here it's another dead body up here why thank you sir why thank you very much there we go ah, i love the music you hear the music in the background so relaxing. Yo. I, I didn't expect this game to have such like soothing music. Because it's like Viking-ish. Thought it was gonna be very crazy. Yeah. Which a lot of the times is, but it's got some really nice the stone quarry. Filled with Britain's supply. The stone quarry. Filled with Britain's supply cards. Once I burn those, we'll push Rotary to peace. All right. Ooh. Ah, perfect. Oh no, what the fuck, dude? All right, well, I guess I'm just going to have to kill you guys the hard way. If that's what you really want. If that's what you really want. Then so be it. Okay, 
Okay, that's a good. I probably should just fucking fight him off. I mean, combat in this game is fun as shit, but. What? That did nothing? Come on, man. Come on, man. Oh, that was brutal. Oh, this guy's coming for the bell. <laughs> There's no bell to freaking ring, you idiot. Same BK, you can have it your way. There's just gonna be a guy over there. So it's all the way down at the bottom. Ooh. Excellent. Why are you guys running? Relax, bro. I'm not here to kill you. I'm only here to aid you. These people have abandoned you. Fuck them all, boys. We ain't fucking around anymore. Fuck them all. Here they come. Here they come. Hiya! <laughs> Stop you on the head, bitch. My name is Avor, and I do not play. So we've got a got a prison report here. Report: Prisoners taken. You're near. We have captured some Saxons as you ordered. They do nothing but shit and complain. Request permission to cut their throats. Come on, man. Come on, man. They do nothing but shit and complain. <laughs> that is actually hilarious. These men will fight for us. You guys are free. Hmm. How do I get one of those? Uh... I wanted to be able to break that what that wall there. This might be an underground passageway. They'll have asked me to free the prisoners to strengthen our field. Shirupshire needs you. Let's go in through here. This looks like this might lead us to some treasure. Oh, we're going under. Okay, okay. Get some iron ore. Perfect. Loot that up. Can we swim up? Ooh. Look at that chest. Oh, wow. He came to our fields and said to us plain, come with me to fight, protect our domain. We took up our sickles, our hammers and chains. We fought with Mer Merton, Merton our Thane. He led us in battle, praised be his name. They came at us like waves again and again. He felled many Britons, their blood fell like rain. Our brother Merton, brave Merton, our Thane. Three foes are over, um, three foes owe overwhelmed them there on the plain he fought on with honor he fought on in vain shed tears for murden murden arthane shed tears for murden murden arthane oh wow look at that shield holy smokes that's cool two skill points i love how you like for discovering things you actually get like skill points, you know, like XP, which obviously translates to skill points. I think that's dope. All right, so let's go here to this, uh, the inventory. Let's see what that looks like.
Let's fucking try it out. Why not? Give some speed. Oh, that's crazy. There's another chest down there that we got to find a cave to go down there. Oh, look at this right here, dude. Look at this right here. We can use this to blow up that wall over there that we weren't able to blow up earlier. Perfect. The hell is that? Oh, is that? Oh. Nickel ingots. And collect. Not half bad. I'll tell you that much. And another opal stone. Is that opal? Opal? I don't know. You will all die. Yes. Got him. Please do not. Now walk on the fire. Oh my god. All right, guys. We have arrived. We've taken the road less traveled, gone through the trees of the forest. Smell that jailbird. Do you smell it? Do you smell what the rock is Eivor, cooking? Jailbird. Hey, Eivor. I was telling the Aetherlink here that Thor is with us this day. Our victory is assured. So, what is your plan? That bastard Anir commands this hamlet. So let us show these folks what happens when a village bows to the Britons. Smash it to kindling, burn it to ashes, and cut Anir's tender throat. Right, my boy? I hope to fight well, not cruelly. The cutting of throats I leave to you. <laughs> Anir must die, our goal is peace. Flames and smoke will warm Rodri's desire for peace. Anir is a lesser concern. Peace is for suckling babes, but as you like. Oh, my blood runs hot. Let us rush in now and leave a trail of bloody kindling. A stealthy approach might earn us more time. Ah, I prefer sound and fury. But do as you must. Hmm. Ah, let's go out. Bloody kindling it is. We will smash this place. We will smash it. Come, Jailbert. The fight is on. Let the Saxon villagers flee, Ivar. Only the Britons deserve our wrath. Thor thunders beside us. Yeah! <laughs> this guy is nuts. What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh, I was about to assassinate you, bro. You're lucky you're a civilian. Oh, oh, nice. We got ourselves some loot. So burn the cottages. Where are the cottages? Oh, that's, oh, oh no, that's not a cottage. This is a cottage, right? Yes. Yes. What? No. Let's see. Oh, I didn't pick up the loot. Wow, I'm an idiot. Let's see. Is this considered a cottage here? I need your eyes, my friend. Maybe not. Yes, it is actually. But then I, I don't know. Let's just keep going. All right. Enough is enough. Look at this guy. He doesn't even see me. Hiya! Our goal is to burn the cottages and do not kill the innocent, please. Yeah, so you see that was a, a cottage back there. Is there any loot in there? Yeah, before I burn it up, I'm going to get the loot. Actually, that's a letter. The letter says, Note on Britons. I know you hate the Britons, but I tell you, they are not so bad. They are straightforward and honest. I love their seaweed cakes and roasted cheese. I have no complaint if they stay here or even win the war. Well, you know what? You deserve for your cottage to be burned. And uh, this guy probably do. And I will assassinate. Oh, stop. Okay, never mind. That worked. But these guys are clueless. Like, do they even know we're, we're, we're here? Like, I mean, they look pretty dumb right now. I'm not even going to lie. Well, what's their IQ number like? Probably not too high, because I'm about to murder your ass. Excelente. Oh, man, they, they are clueless. It's obviously the cloak. When you have the cloak, you're... Oh, look. 
Papia! What are you doing swinging that thing around, bro? How about you come and swing these nuts? <laughs> Sorry. Just keep it PG 13 and a half. Uh, hold on before i do anything let me let me go in here and i gotta loot the oh we need a key one of these guys has a key right wait wait who's got the key oh crap you guys really want to fuck around fuck around with the underground get away get away from me please get away from the entrance of my castle yeah, I need to calm down. I just had coffee like three times back to back and uh, seems like I am uh, a little bit over over my own head here. So this guy's got the key to the chest. Most likely. Look at him practicing. For what? What are you practicing for? You're dead. <laughs> what? Oh, he's got two keys? What? Does he have two keys? Oh, well, I guess we'll find out. God damn, bro. Did I loot him? Okay, what does it do that? Like, I'm literally spamming try uh, Y on that body and nothing happens as far as picking up the key. Look at Chailbert. What a savage. Do you, bro. Do you, baby boy. All right, let me go in here and get this chest just because it's important. I think. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Looks important. It's pretty big. Nice. Nickel ingots. Well, that is important, actually. All right, let's go burn some of the other cottages just to get this over with. Our job here is done. I wish there was a better way to grab those essentials from the scroll wheel. Maybe like holding one of the left top buttons or something. Because if you like, you got to hold down on the D-pad, so then it just slows you down. Nah, but then, yeah, if you do, then you can't block. You know, I could have actually burned this one over here. Hold on. Uh, Avor's arm's a little bit too strong there. Why isn't it burning? Hello? Bro. Less support for Rotary. Oh, we did it already. Nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. The shield, if you uh, if you do uh, parries, you have a chance to... Uh, to go on fire, as you can see right here. Oh, wait, no. It's the, is that the torch? Oh, that's my torch. But, yeah, you could do that with this uh, shield. If you do a, a perfect parry... There's a chance you might get like a blaze of fire. Which is pretty cool. Okay, I think we're done. Kill an ear and his men. Where is this guy? Oh, uh, where is this man? Come here, boy! You better get an ass whooping! Yes! Come to daddy! Oh, civilian casualties. Fuck. Okay, uh, Ivar, you were talking all that shit, so I'm you see. So I'm gonna need your assistance right now. I'm gonna need your services right now, pal. Why? Why? That's not the guy I'm trying to kill. This is the guy I'm trying to kill. Okay, here we go. This is actually extremely, extremely good. Gotta hit the G-spots. Come on. Out of the arm. Amazing. The range attacks are sometimes probably not as fun, but they are very good. So we just got to finish off his men. Let me try out that spear. I don't think we've ever tried out a spear before. That looks quite uh, interesting. Where is it? 48? Oof, man, it's very, very low. I don't think I can change it now. Can you change it when you're in the middle of a uh, in the middle of a battle? Yes. Oh wow, but it's much faster. 
Whoa, what the freaking hell? Whoa! Oh my god, the spear's insane. Okay, well maybe <laughs> maybe I should be rocking out with the spear then. Okay, where, where are his other men? Oh, let's just speak to this. Okay, regroup with Ivar. They're all dead. Where are you going, maniac? This guy's guy freaking crazy. Eivor, did you see Chilbert fight? He is all balls now. I give thanks for victory and ask penance for taking lives. Oh, Chilbert, your god bores me to death. Have a laugh. We won. And I took no pleasure in it, Ivar. Eivor and I were made for this, my boy. The song of swords, the blood mist, the bone crunch and baring of teeth. Is this enough blood paid, Ivar? We've spilled enough to slake the thirst of Femini. Why stop there? Tailbet, I would know your mind on all this. Are you satisfied with our victory? I... I believe I am. I'll need word from Rodri as soon as possible. What does he intend? He will see the flames. He will know Esbury has been destroyed. The bleeding pus pit claims only a dragon can defeat him. We will soon put that to the test. It is peace we want, Ivar, not revenge. If you cannot accept that, return to Repton now. You do not know Rodri as I do, Eivor. You do not know what a slippery, lying shit he can be. Enough talk of killing. Oh, I need a moment of calm. You need me. No, Ivar. True calm. A walk in the woods to clear the air. Or fishing. Would you go fishing with me? Fishing, huh? Looking for a warm puddle to dangle your worm in? I saw a small pond nearby. Will you come? We can all take a moment to allow our <laughs> blood to cool. This guy is on some other shit. <laughs> a warm a pond to no put your worm in. What? Where is the sport in it? There's no chance the fish will kill me. I mean, if you look at it like that, I mean, oh yeah, I guess it's not an extreme sport. Here will be good. Let's fish for eel. Dale have relishes nettle soup cooked with eels fresh from the water. I will not fish. You go ahead. All I have are my weapons. Okay, so are we supposed to fish with this? Okay, we've got one there. Maybe, maybe if we go on top of this rock, we might get just an overall better view. Let's go on top of this rock. Okay. Yo, that one's going fast. Bro, as soon as you throw the freaking arrow, they start swimming like crazy. Okay. What? Did I get that one? I think I did. No, that's the one I killed earlier. Oh, wow. This is so much easier. Let me get this chest here while we're at it. Why not, right? I'm hoping that I can break that. Yes. Very nice. Yeah, I think I'm probably better off telling them like this. There we go. Alright, we got enough? Well, that was funny. Or if I like to use a fishing rod at least. I do this like a total freaking barbarian. Which we kinda are, but you know. That took longer than clearing this village. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. We caught some eel for a feast. The bishop should be pleased. 
The simple fellow comes now. Ah, a strange way to celebrate victory. But then again, our Christ was a fisher of souls, was he not? Bishop, greetings. We've the makings for a delicious soup. I'm grateful, Chelbert, but my heart is heavy. So many homes burnt. We'll be years rebuilding. You should have seen Chelbert fight. He will be an elderman with sack and guts, fearsome and raw. I should rather be fair and just, but I take the compliment. I have sent word to the Britons. I pray King Rodri will again be open to peace, in spite of his brother's murder. It worked in our favor. Look where we landed. Britons begging for mercy like whiny pups. Ivar is right. Do not have yet peace. Ivar is... We set the village ablaze, yes. But peace is not guaranteed. And it will take another sort of skill to win it. Restraint. Our next steps are critical, my lords. And after what happened in Quatford, it is clear to me that Ivar should lay low. Lay low? After all I have done here, you tell me to dunk my head? The good bishop is right, Ivar. You have a warrior's heart, not a peacemaker's. Fuck you, Wolf. <laughs> I know Rodri, and I know the kind of tricks he will pull. That is me warning you. If you hear me farting, that is my welcome to the bastard. You bruised his pride, Eivor. If you have some balm for it, by all means, share it. His pride makes him difficult, and his anger makes him hasty. But he is not without honest feeling. I will hunt him a great boar, I think. And together we'll roast it over a fire and tell tales of war. That should please him. Bishop, we must prepare for Rodri's arrival. Rally our men and set up a camp just here. I guess we took over the uh, the settlement here. Peace or war will be decided, but not yet, not now. We must wait. I loathe waiting. It is all in God's hands. We can but pray and give thanks for this moment of rest. The Britons have come. Uh -oh. The moment has ended. This way, by the great oak. Where is Chaelbert? He ought to be present for these talks as our future elderman. He went hunting. For wild boar, he said. That was quite some time ago, no? We cannot wait. Uh-oh. We should settle the peace now. Well, that's the wife Lady of the... Of the... Harrod, yeah. Greetings. We come to speak of peace. We are glad and to hear it. But where is your great king? He stays at the castle at my behest. I feared his presence would inflame the cutthroat Ivar. Ivar is not here either. The best road is the way. Rodri should be here. Hmm. Rodri. Sorry. You are wise to leave him behind. Your husband breathed the fire of war in a land of kindling. Here, we must have peace. Perhaps then, at long last, we can end this war. Our peoples have suffered enough. And your proposal? We shall withdraw all our soldiers to the time-honored border of our lands. We ask only that you give us some days to collect our furnishings and leave Kausto Castle. In return, you pledge to end all hostilities as of this moment. These terms are generous. We have a truce. Truly. Praise be, this is well and quickly done. God go with you and your king, Lady Angharad. I salute you all. You waged a good war. Let us now wage a lasting peace. I stand bewildered, Eivor. In the blink of an eye, years of blood and sweat are put to an end. You have walked a difficult road, Bishop. Chaelbert must learn the good news. Will you tell him when you see him? I'll find him now. Oh, Chaelbert! We have peace. We have found peace in the Middle East. I don't really know if we are in the Middle East.
Two birds. Where's the wild boar? I'm getting kind of hungry, man. Where in Hellheimer has Tailbat gone to? Okay, where the one here must know. Speak to the guards near Chilberts. Where the hell is this guy? So, letter to Chilberts' son, Bishop Dearlaf, informs me that you are making the fine progression towards becoming a leader. I doubt it not. Soon you'll be Elderman. And when my time on earth is done, you will be king. Your father, Chill Wolf of Mercy. Aw. Have you seen Chilbert? I don't keep track of the comings and goings of the Arderling. Ask another. Ah, fuck off. How about you? I'm looking for Chilbert. Have you seen him? Last I saw, he was sharpening arrowheads. Um, yeah, these guys are literally of no help. Hey, Eivor. Have you seen Chilbert? My brother saw him last. Uh... Wake him up, dude. Wake his ass up right now. Drunk as a mackerel, isn't he? Celebrating the peace. Got started early. Wake up. <laughs> huh? Where is Chilbert? Chilbert? Did none of you see Chilbert? Only him, Drenger. You will have to wait until he sleeps it off. I will How wait. How long before he's fit to speak, would you say? A few hours should do it. Unless you find another way to rouse him. Must be some way I can wake this drunk. Okay, well, how about we just go to sleep? Or meditate? That ought to do it. That ought to do it. How about now? Is he awake? Drunk and loud. Should be awake by now. Ah, oh, now you're awake. Have huh, a you nice little... nap. What country is this? <laughs> I am looking for Chilbert. Have you seen him? If you must know, the little brat went off hunting boar some time ago. Yes, I know. But where was he hunting? He went south. That's all I know. Probably followed the stream here, south to the forest. That's enough to go on. Thank you. Open your map. South of the stream. Follow stream south of okay, so south and then look for a stream. Let's see. Okay, so this is the stream right here. Let me call my mount. Probably get there faster. On my handy dandy wolf. And we'll just head south and follow the stream. Ah, I see. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Bloody path to peace. Okay, so now that's the stream. Okay, the stream is leading us this way. Perfect. I don't want to drift away too far. Is that the stream right there? Oh, won't you look at that? Excellent. All right, Wolf. Thanks for the ride, I guess. We are no longer in need of uh, services. I will go on foot like the Viking that I am. And I will climb my happy ass over here. And I think it's straight over here. Are we on the right path? Yep. Some rations. We are full of rations. What happened here? This doesn't look good. Uh-oh. Oh my god, what the frick just happened? Oh no. What the frick just happened? Chao Bert! What is going on here, Mirren? Uh, answer me! Are you dead or alive? Oh fuck. Okay, that probably is. What is that? Wolf? Okay, so. Oh, that's probably the wolf's blood. The wolf's blood. No, it's not. Is that his blood, dude? Is that his blood? I'll be damned. Oh. 
bro. He got. Oh, dude, he got smoked by the wolves or what? I really hope he's alive, man. Ooh. Please don't be dead. We need you alive, son. Blood, not from a boar. A wolf dragging something through the dirt. That's his blood, dude. Wait, how the fuck do they? Jailbirds. Oh. Tears of Rhea. Jailbird, you live. The fuck? I. Uh, Stay quiet. You're badly hurt. A dragon on the hilt. Guards. The Briton crest. Keep breathing, boy. Oh, you haven't got long. I will take you back to say your goodbyes. What the frickin' heck? I can get you to the others. I'll go easy. How does this even happen? Like, how, how do you go hunting for boar and you get stabbed up? What is... I thought we had trained you to be a professional killer, man. Now I get... Save your strength. Oh, wow. All right, so now we're just headed back. Headed back to... uh, Back to camp, I guess you can say. Some help here! Eva! Down up! By the hand of Thor! Is that the other? Oh my god, Eivor. dude. What happened? No. No! You foolish boy, what did you do? I found him deep in a cave beset by wolves. Eva. Easy, boy. Easy. E Eva. Get me an axe right fucking now! Eva. He's gone. An axe! His god will take him as he is. Axe or not. Go to your god, boy. And I will sing for you in Valhalla. This was no wolf. Tell me what happened. It was the Britons. The Britons did this. I found this blade in his chest. Britain's dagger. Rodri! But why? You murdered his brother. Did you think he would let that lie so easily? I told you he was a trickster. Peace was never his goal. He takes blood for blood. Bishop Deolav, over here. The walls of his fortress will not protect him. I will sheet this dagger into his lungs. We must move fast then. Attack before Rodri can revel in his trick. No mercy this time, Wolf Kissed. You spared that wet turd Leofrit. We will not spare Rodri. I swear. Lord above, what's happened? Chaelbert! Murdered. May the Lord who frees you from sin save you and raise you up. Send the boy's body to his father. The one the Christian burial. Lady Angharad said Rotary is holed up in Kausto Castle. That may have been a lie or a tiny slip. Either way, we should find out. There is a spot near the fortress to set up camp. We will scout it together. A good plan. We go now. Fine. And remember, leave Rotary to me. Wow, dude. Is that the what the heck happened? How did it just kill him like that? King Killer. Uh. All right, so do we just you men, mount up and follow me? There's work to be done. Fine, we'll take a horse this time around. Come on, Ivar. Move that ass. 
I don't got time to be waiting all day. Let's go. I should have known he would come for the weakest of us. You opened a bloody wound when you killed Rodri's brother. Anything worth doing must be paid for in blood. What the hell was the point of us giving the, the, the silver in the beginning of the episode? In Quartford, you told me Rodri gave you that scar on your face. Is it a story worth telling? If not worth telling, it is worth remembering. Years ago, I was headed back from the Western Isle. Ah, they have got the fighters there. I had taken a bit of a beating. Put me in a surly mood. I wanted blood and silver, nothing more. So, me and my friend here, sailing along the coast of Camry, see a nice spot for landing, covered in mist. We drag our ships ashore. And just then, a cry came from atop a hillock. The troll cursed Britons. The fog clears a bit. And there they are, all lined up. The biggest one calls out. I am Rodri, king of this land. That means shit to me. I scream back. <laughs> I give my boys a nod, and we raise up our axes and charge before they take a breath. We have the numbers, but the Britons are clever. It's marshland. The bog catches our boots, sucks us to a standstill. One by one, Rodri cuts us to bits. He gets to me, lays his blade at my cheek, and gives me this nick. Leave this land and wow. give your people fair warning, he says. Tell them King Rodri gave you that cut. Hen shit, I say. Rodri laughs and lets me go. Quite a story, Ivar. Son of Ragnar, killer of kings, conqueror of England and the Western Isle. You have lived a saga worth ten. That I have. A saga worth ten. Wow. That sweat sopped slug is just beyond those walls. May only be defeated by a dragon. My itching ass. <laughs> He'll meet one, all right. Send a message to your men. We can build a camp here and lay plans for a surprise attack. Oh, uh, we're about to assault. It's go time. We're going to hit an assault on, on the castle. Ivar's men waste no time. They're eager to pay out our revenge. Oh, yeah. All right. So we're going to go up there to talk with Ivar and get to work. Let's get to work. No time to be wasted. It is time to kill. I am ready. What in the name of Loki have you done? Golden the dragon to oh, what the hell? <laughs> he no gets that too. Are you ready for war? Oh, he put a dragon in his face. Is that ready what it is? Man, Ivar. Let's have at it. It is a good day to die. The gate looks to be well defended. My men are loading a cart with cauldrons of oil. We will blast right through that fucking gate. Oh, man. <sighs> Yeah, sure. Not cringe. Totally, totally very cool. <laughs> oh my god. We are here in the middle of Castal Castle. I am here, boneless Ragnarsson. How is it you come in force when our peace has been concluded? Do not mock us, whore son. You splattered blood on our peace with the butchery of young Chalbert. Speak what nonsense you please, Dane. If you mean war, our defenses are sure. Gaze upon my face, King of Damn. Good, and meet the dragon that will devour you. I see a spent old man playing at serpents. Enough talking, Ivar. Bring the oil cart and set the fires. When I am done with Rotary, I will tear the fat from his shanks and use it to fry our bread. Wow. Oh, 
All right, so breach the main gate. Escort the old cart to the gate. Get the wagon to the gate. All right, let's let us let us get some battle going on here. Stomp them. Yeah, that's right. Man, let me tell you, the spear is much lower in damage, but it is so much faster. For one attack you do with the with the axe, you can do like three with the spear. Oh, that was kind of pointless. Okay, should we go over there? Should we just? Yeah, let's 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 get rid of those uh those guys over there throwing arrows. It's gonna slow down the cart. There we go. The archers will pay in blood. The archers will play a uh, play play. Yeah, we'll play. They will pay in blood. Oh fuck! Come on. Oh my god, what is this? Oh my god. Oh my god, how many of them are there here? What the frick is going on? Oh my god, there's so many of them. They keep coming. <laughs> help! Somebody help me up here. Dude, what the frick is this? Okay, it's ready. The cart is ready. Okay, the cart is ready. Perfect. Dude, that could be like a little... Like a farming zone, really, if you go there. Holy smokes. So how many people were there? Jesus. Alright, everybody get back. Everybody get back. You didn't get back. Okay, he's still alive. Good. Everybody attack! Y'all sons of bitches gonna die! <laughs> oh yeah. Mario dying. Sorry for the random shit. Let me get some more rations here. Oh, I'm full. Nice. Just get a couple of hits in. Anything to, to help out the homies, right? Stomp them. See, that's how you do it, man. I am not eternal, so you better learn now or forever. Be dependent on a superior warrior such as myself. Well, that's one way to get down. Well, we're going to go ahead and open up the gates. Ah, shoot the links to lower the drawbridge. Uh, okay. I'm assuming the drop. Oh, drawbridge over there. Oh, there is a lot of people here, man. We got to be careful. You guys are crazy. That's my squad right there. Whooping that ass. Oh, look at these archers up there. Don't you for a second think that Eivor is not an archer himself. He's a very disciplined young man and he will kill you. Wait. There we go. Perfect. We got to do the other side. We've done this before in one of the previous missions. So I'm sure we are good to go. Ooh. Let's go. You will die. It's through there. Protect the cattle. Protect the king, my ass. You're dead, bitch. Mm. Mm. Uh. Your king is dead. Ah, uh, Ivar. Leave him to me, Ivar. I will get the XP. Oh, fuck. Evar, don't kill him. That's not actually, that's not Evar. 
And this guy killed him. How dare you? Little shit. That's fine. <laughs> Force open the gates. Hey, can't do this alone. By the way, where is Ivar? Oh, there he is. This guy's crazy, man. Okay, I, somebody help me. Seriously, come on. This is a joke right now. Give me a hand over here. Ivar the Boneless. <laughs> You make a pitiful dragon. Yo, this is hardcore. <laughs> Bro, he threw alcohol on him. To burn him. What a fucking psycho. Wow. The man is gone crazy. Not gonna lie, that was pretty crazy. <laughs> that was pretty nuts. Ivar, I'm gonna have to respect a little more from now on because you're a little nuts. You're a little cuckoo for coke puffs. Dude is uh I failed yeah. the rotting old oak. He's not dead. No. I have something else planned. Spectacle, remember? Let him go. He's dying. Finish him quickly. You have won. I'm gonna do it for good karma. If you will not kill him now, then let him go. Humiliation will chase him to the end of his days. Oh no! This will be good. I have something specific in mind. A place and a method. Come. All right. Let's get this over with. Load this lump of lard onto your horse and we will go. Take care he stays alive. Mm. Eivor, do not forget that load of rotten flesh called Rotary. We'll come back and we'll, we'll loot this place up. After, let's just get this mission Where are we going? over with. An overlook I found while scouting. A view, one fit for a dying king. There's no need for spectacle, Ivar. Let the man die with honor. No, no, no. He must die with style. This guy is crazy. What are you doing? Ah. Come on, dude. Where in the name of Loki have you gone to? Come on, bro. Okay, you are pissing me off right now. There we go. Yeah, this dude is out of his mind. He's got to be mentally unstable. How are you doing, dear king? Stay with us. You must not miss what is coming. He has got to be mentally unstable. He is crazy, man. I killed King Ella, King Osbard, King Edmund, and now King Roderick. Who else can claim such a string of victories? Just finish. It is not my place to interfere in this feud. Dude. I think we're taking him atop that mountain over there with the birds, if not very close. Valhalla must look such a sight. Hmm. But I really loved Does about that times still? back then. Barely. Rodri. Are you listening? 
For years I wore this scar with shame. Nicked by a Briton and left alive. I tried to cover it with a beard, a cloak. But as your fame grew, I began to beam with pride. A king gave me this mark. What say you to this, Rodri? Huh? Speak up, you old bag of sweat and grease. I was saying back in the days they believe they believed so much in gods and like I don't know it was such a nice Here time like the belief Bring it was so close. magical you know now it's like not everybody believes in God and shit Over here. back then they believed in different gods too like, you know like Thor and fucking you know a bunch of gods humankind was a little different and it was beautiful in its own way there to the top and keep him breathing finish this quickly Ivar <clears throat> see here a hungry blade now comes the dragon to feed on his favorite meal the blood eagle Ivar, is this? The birth of a blood eagle is a sight to behold, my friend. First, I slice the length of your spine. Yo, this guy is crazy. What the hell is he doing? Blood Eagle has no true meaning for Ivar. He is doing it simply to take pleasure in suffering. Now, I pull back the flesh. The method will always outlive the meaning. Few in time will care why this man died. But now, that is a song for the ages. What the hell is he doing? Is he really skinning him alive? The fog between good and evil grows thick over time. But glory never fades. There is nothing glorious here. Life is not pretty. It is a bloody fight. Out come the lungs. And we spread them like wings. What the frick is he doing to that man? Bro, oh my god. All of mercy Did he just crucify him? I have seen enough. Look at the flap of his skin, bro. This guy is crazy. Ever. This saga we have written together, it needs an ending. Here and now. It is ended, Ivar. I'm done with this place. A fight to the death. You and me. If I win. I Why? The greatest Vikinger who ever lived. If I lose, what a tale you have to tell. You are battle drunk, Ivar. Goodbye. Poor Chelbert. He barely said a word. When? I pushed that dragon dagger into his heart. No. What a fucking Just a bitch! Soft little squeal. And nothing. You sick, cursed fuck out! <laughs> the things a man must do. The trials one must face. The friends one must betray. To achieve one's destiny. And become king killer forevermore. Traitor! Jailbird was like a son to me! Yes! Yes! So fight me, Wolfkiss, to a glorious death! What the f This is a life, Eivor! To fight high above the world! Valhalla awaits! What the fuck? Oh, this guy's dodging now? Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I can't believe he killed Chain Wolf, dude. What the fuck? 
Unbelievable. I kind of don't want to believe it, really. Wow. Un Unreal, man. <laughs> I can't believe what he just said. Did he really just do that, man? Like, he he faked everything. He blamed it on the king so he could actually... Watch out! So he can actually make us think that the king killed him and we would come to war and then he would kill the king. Therefore, breaking the peace and breaking everything that Vikings stand for, you piece of shit! Yeah, I don't know if this spear is the best for this. Oh, what the fuck? Asshole. <laughs> Bitch. Yo, he's pretty good, though. I'm not even gonna lie. What the fuck? I went for a stun attack! God. Come down. Ow, ow, I'll be gone to enjoy this. I'm a fucking idiot. Death is just a cold, windless sea. No banquet, no door, no fire, no revels. Uh, yeah, I need some health. I need me some health, man. Let me ask you something. What, what did you just stop fighting? <laughs> Speak then, or I take your tongue. Will you see your father in Valhalla, Wolf Kissed? Or is the coward in Helheim weeping tears of ice? Oh, what a son of a bitch, my father. Ah! What a son of a bitch! Ah, Go again! Wow. See, now I'm not going to play your game anymore. Now I'm going to wait for you to strike. And I'm just going to parry everything. Because you are a little bitch. Bleed like jailbird. Oh, that's the red one. I can't do that. I can't dodge that. I mean, I can't parry that. Oh, he's crazy. literally insane so close to death. So cold is my heart. oh my Where god the winged maidens man my long road ends the valkyries approach Unbelievable. My axe, Eivor, hand me my weapon. Send to what? Yeah, I'm gonna send them, bro. He's. Just... What am I gonna Odin do? may have use for you, but this is more than you deserve. Uh, do not shame him. Dude, that man was nuts, bro. Uh, that man was nuts. Wow, dude. Carry the body to Quadford. We'll say our goodbyes there. 
and send a message to Uber. Tell him his brother is dead. Speak to Duraloff. All right, so we got a fast travel to Quat Ford's longhouse. Come raise a cup and look. Hmm. See what happens. Avo, hello. Oh, that's Uba. Another dark day clouds our victory. Bishop, Uba, dead at the hands of a Briton. I cannot imagine the shame my brother felt in his final hour. Were it not for this peace, I killed him. You? After peace was made, Eva murdered Chelbert and pinned the crime on Rotary to get another swing at him. How do you come to know this? He told me himself. I am always one who desires the truth, Eivor, but this... This is a hard thing to hear. Did he die well? Yeah, I think he did. <clears throat> he died a fighter in all his glory. As he wanted then. With Ivar gone, peace and quiet are now possible. That is something. I will console myself for the thought that we will meet again in Valhalla. Axe in hand. You will. For good or ill, he lived life by his own rules. What man can say better? He lived his life at cross purposes. I often found him strange and his actions puzzling. But not all men are meant to be understood. He needs a proper farewell. I will prepare a ship for his funeral pyre. Bishop, send word to Lady Angharad. Say that her husband died by treachery. And that Ivar has paid the price for it. As soon as I am able. Have you heard from King Chaelwolf? I cannot imagine his grief. He is felled by it. Still, he makes plans for this shire. I am to be Elderman here. Therefore, Shiropshire declares herself your friend and ally, and will remain so for the length of my days. I am grateful, Bishop. God go with you, Eivor, wherever you may lead. Damn, dude. Feels crazy, but it's still kind of like sad, you know? I believe it was him that gave us an axe. Um, when we finished the Letter Chestershire chapter. Wow. Of battle song. The boneless one sails into a singing glory on a flaming water steed. Wow, dude. Wind across the water. The battle maidens beat their wings to carry a king to Odin's hall of corpses. Ivar gone. Shirapshire, an ally. I should confer with Randvi. The King Killer. All right, guys. So next up is to head over to our settlements and see what happens. That was great. That was a good, 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 good chapter. Really good storytelling. I really enjoyed it. I really hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, thank you for watching. Still, the game is long, but we're still at it. I don't know when we'll end it, but we'll keep going and hopefully we'll get to the end. But uh, yeah, again, thank you so much. If you enjoyed it, drop it a like. I would really appreciate it. And I will catch you on the next one.